Okay, people, I'm here at C2E2, and we are going to look at some some pops. Um, there's some interesting stuff right away that I noticed. Is we got some good stuff. Look at this. We got Fruit Pie Magician, sixty-five dollars. Okay. Uh, and they got Jason Voorhees. Got them with a sack on his head over here for forty-five. I'm going to take a quick little walk. I'm going to look at this Jason. Oh, look. Look at Jason Voorhees. $30. Whoa. So interesting. Prices vary by two feet. Yes. Oh, man. <laughs> look at this. Oh, whoa. Some more on this side. Look at that. Look at this toy area. There's so many toys. Some more Funko products. I gotta say, this chase is probably the loneliest chase. Because <laughs> <laughs> everywhere I go, I always see that one. He's still sitting, even at like Second and Charles and where I live back home. He's been sitting there. That same chase has been sitting there for almost a year. Oh no. <laughs> poor poor uh, dog and nobody yeah. wants him. <laughs> Okay. Oh, excuse me. Sorry. Oh man, look at that. Yeah, some oh, spider hawk. That's some good stuff. Let's see Dumbo. Do you guys have any Pez by chance? Yeah, uh, I'll tell you pegboard right there on the end. Cool, thanks. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I got hot ones. Oh look, man, you can see these. We got some cool stuff. Oh look, Walmart exclusive, only 14. That's pretty fair. Box thing, so look at this $14. Good price, but like it's a bit rough. A bit beaten, man. Not good. I'm gonna put this back before they try to blame it on me. 18. Oh, they got that Star Lord. Oh, man. Okay, people. I'm gonna go back to the other view. I'm gonna keep looking around. So we see there's a lot of pops here. Uh, let's go. Where do we want to go? I just got done with Toki Doki. Didn't think I was going to get that exclusive, but I did. Oh man. So let's let's walk around the con. Let's see. There's a lot of great cosplay. A lot of good stuff going on here. Do 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 do. Let's see. If you guys see any pops, say I see pops. Right. Oh look, more. So I was here yesterday. It's Plastic Empire. We got this really cool mystery box. Um, going on. Choose whichever one you want. We got some there. We got some on the table as well. It's pretty neat. Look at this mystery boxes. They say that some of they include some of them include the Tokyo Batman and the Vegeta Chrome. It's awesome. Hello Ava, how are you? You tuning in again today? I'll be out live hopefully tomorrow as well. Just kind of uh hello mole. What do you guys want me to look at? You want me to look at any specific ones? Got some Dragon Ball Z. I have every single one of those. Most of the Marvels. Jason Voorhees here. Uh, Hot Topic exclusive 30. Nice. Mm -mm. Mm. Oh, we got some more signed up there. Tokyo. 425. If I got that lucky at that box, I would have a heart attack. Oh man. So what's the plural, man? We go. We're gonna go ahead and film, film, film. I know, and then I'm gonna do a giveaway. So share my page. And once I reach a hundred, I will be giving away. Uh, I already got the couple I was looking for. I didn't necessarily come looking to buy anything for me today. I went looking for friends. I got myself a. Jiren Pop for $38. I mean, you can't beat that price. That's even cheaper than Galactic Toys, who had it first. So, so um, I got some Pop signed. That's the main reason I came. Got a, a lot of my Dragon Ball Z ones signed by Chris Sabat and all of them. So, it was pretty awesome. And I was just over at this other booth. They had two of the same Pops, but different prices. It was really interesting. Really interesting. See, they have these uh, tag guns, which is awesome, because I'm going to tell you, as somebody who sells these, it takes a long time to put these stickers on there without one of those. Mm -hmm. Two supporters away, huh? Once I get to 100 uh, followers, I'll be um, subscribers. I'll be actually giving away a King King Ding Dong. 
so it's gonna be really cool. Oh man. I do got Twitter, it's the same exact name. Oh man, I went over there, this guy has a Billy for 30, and then the exact same one, two feet down for 45. <laughs> it's like, oh man. Uh, he has a, actually, has like, it's like three deep, all for 30, and then one over here for 45. And then he had a, uh, oh no, not a Billy, it was a Jason Voorhees. And then he had the Billy for 75. He's like, ever since it's been vaulted, it's been going up in price. No, it hasn't, I'm looking at the price right now. It's $30. What are you talking to? Yeah. <laughs> Oh man, you're at 99 supporters. Okay, one away and then I'll do a giveaway. Okay. Oh man, I'm so tempted to get one of those mystery boxes. They keep they keep burning on me. See, I already I came with all my pops to get signed, so I have so many already. So, but but it's very tempting. Well, you guys have a good one. I'm gonna keep looking. Oh man, okay. One more. Share, share, share. And then I'll do a giveaway. I'm gonna be giving away a, a King Ding Dong. I'll even get thrown a hard stack with it too. It's a pretty nice little ad icon. Most people kind of missed out on that one, but you know, still a couple floating around. Oh look, we got Rocco's Modern Life. I need to get somebody to do 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 do. Do you follow back on Twitter? Yeah, I can follow you back. What's your Twitter handle? My Twitter's popcentric one. But yeah, throw your uh, Twitter handle in the comments. I'll follow you back if I see you follow me. No problem. Oh, man. Let's go, people. There, there are so many mystery boxes here. I've never seen so many mystery boxes in my life. There's like every single row has at least three mystery box dealers. I went seen one. He's like, it's $60. It's a great value. There will be 12 pops with an Amazon value of $120. And I'm like, oh, cool. Are there any exclusives or anything in there? He goes, no, it's all commons. I'd go bankrupt if I was giving you exclusives at that price. Uh, not really, because you're probably buying them all at retail. Um, but yeah, let's keep looking. Let's keep looking. You guys see anything cool yet? Pops, 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 pops. Oh, let me go to the Fugitive Toys ones for y'all who missed it. And Galactic Toys, they're over here. Uh, I saw Galactic Toys, they had the gear and they had for $50. And then I kept walking, I saw another dude selling it for, for $38. He said he's giving away one with every three boxes you purchase, so... Wow, Bill's old fashioned soda pop. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, we're heading over to, I think, the Fugitive Toys booth, which is over here. Maybe Galactic Toys. Uh, but yeah, right now I'm hunting for some friends. We're looking for, we've got some Pezzes, we're looking for some horror pops, a couple of anime ones. Yeah. And, uh, Dude, dude, up. Here we go. We're picking up on our... Looks like Galactic Toys. Here we go. Let's take a look at what they got. Okay. Oh, well, look, they got that boob. new Bulbasaur. $15. Well, that's a very fair price. Uh, 12 each or 2 for 20. Uh, Galona Dark Todoroki. Mmm. 50, 50, 10 each on the Funko Official Pop Stacks. I was at just at FYE and they had that Diamond Edition. Um, Freddie, uh, Freddie Mercury that just came out. Pardon me, guys. So, you see, there's a lot of people here. This place is crowded. Crowded as can be. Jiren, $60. I'm so excited I got it for $38. Look at that. Look at this. They got a lot of good pops. The thing about here is you gotta really hunt around if you see something you like, because there's probably somebody else who might have it. Same exact value. A ball rock for 60. Had that a while ago. Oh man, look at those Dragon Balls. Mm. One thing I wish they had was oh they. Uh, the, you guys see anything cool? Okay, everybody, that's Galactic Toys. Let's look for Fugitive Toys. I think they're right around the corner over here. Oh, more Galactic Toys. They got they have pops on both sides. Let's take a look. Got some great cosplay over here. Oh, look at this. This looks like they have more of the exclusives and hard to find stuff on this side. Because I don't think anyone's going to get a hotel. A lot, a lot of stuff. Yeah, we're over at the Me? I have my personal collection. Excuse me. I probably have, I have nearly every single Marvel pop with the, just missing a couple. And I have almost all the Dragon Ball Z pops just missing a couple. 
So I don't. I probably have a thousand, maybe. And then my store, I probably have a few hundred. But most it's all comments now. All my good stuff got bought up at my last trade event that I went to. Let me turn notifications off. I don't want that to. How many pops do you have? Do, do, do. Sorry. <laughs> the Boba's sold for 15. That's a steal. That really is. So. Oh man, I like that Tony Stark for 30 too. That one's really cool. It's one of the ones I'm missing. Um, look at that. I think uh, Nintendo learned from the Pikachu fiasco. They made Charmander and Bulbasaur both commons. They're like. You know what's crazy is at the Target where I'm at, a guy uh, waited with a lawn chair and didn't get one. The next day he came back and they sold out. He laid on the floor and cried and called the police on Target. Yeah, he got escorted out. <laughs> didn't last long. Well, you yeah, guys have a good one. Oh, man. Okay, people. You know what's funny is it's telling me there's zero viewers, but I see you guys talking to me, so I know it's not true. Um, how many, well, how many, what's your uh, Twitter handle? And also, uh, what is your, um, what is your, how many pops do you have? Okay, oh, look, there's some more pops. I see them over there. Let's go look, oh look, it's a Geico lizard. Hey, buddy. Uh, oh man, this one's cool, VRV, 991. Man, I love VRV. I don't know if you guys have ever used it, but in terms of anime streaming, it has everything. It's the best thing Crunchyroll has ever done is VRV. <laughs> uh, I hope you're not streaming. I am streaming. Okay. Do you, how, are you a verb user? Of course I am. I have it on my phone. I can show you right now. Wait, how long have you been Have you been around? Forever. forever? Literally forever, since it started. Have a uh, month on me. Oh, thank you. <laughs> yeah, I love it. You know, every time I uh, see something new, I'm always telling them, hey, have you guys thought about putting yourself on VRV? I uh, every day <laughs> shudder, or not shudder, um, there was an anthology by um, that went on there by... Uh, it was a uh, sci-fi one from a oh, sci-fi yeah, channel. Yeah, yeah, Every day I would comment them and be like, hey, you guys want to be on VRV? Hey, and they're like, we're working on it. We'll talk to you. And they eventually went on. I was so excited. And there's another one now that's uh, from College Humor uh, that's out. That they have their own channel called Dropout. I'm like, hey, VRV, VRV. Every time I see them post a video, VRV, VRV. Because they want $3 a month. VRV. We have, a, we have a, a panel today at 1230. Okay. And we're premiering a new show called Live from WZRD. So you should check that out. I will. First is it 1230? It's at 1230. Yeah, I'll be back. All right. Nice. Yeah, I'll be back. Yeah, I'm, like I said, I harass Dropout on College Humor all the time because what would be better on VRV than a dedicated, like, humor channel like yep. that's all around comedy because that's like one thing that it's really missed it's got horror it's got anime it's got nick splat it's got literally everything yep. so it's got something for everybody yep <laughs> 12 the panels and what time again i don't know but it's called uh world of verbs and what does vrv stand for was it as an acronym for something or they just chose vrv i think they just chose vrv i just i've always called it verb yeah so. or verb i <laughs> i don't know how to pronounce it but i love it yeah. funimation made a huge mistake but it was Sony. Sony. Yeah, no, it was all fun. Sony. The Sony's like, we can bring you worldwide better. But no, they, no, they, no, they can't. <laughs> Just like Spider-Man. <laughs> yeah, have a good one. Thank you. Okay, people, you heard that. I'm coming back at 1230. I love Verb. Love VIP. They're premiering a new show. I'm excited. I'm definitely going to be checking out that panel. Okay, back to where I was going, which was... I saw some Funko products. Oh, there it is. Funko. Let's go take a look and see what these people have. So what is your guys' grails? What what pop have you always, always wanted? Oh, look at these mystery boxes. Each box, only $40. Have a chance at this. But don't worry. I wonder if there's a guaranteed box value. Is there a guaranteed box value on this? Uh, no, there's no guarantee. You're guaranteed four comments per box with a one in three chance of getting one of the exclusives. Okay. And then each one also has a raffle ticket to win the Blue Chrome Batman. So okay. 300 boxes, 300 tickets. Got it. It's like a waffle on steroids. <laughs> awesome, I'm gonna come around here and look too. <laughs> you guys heard that. So, oh man, look, they got all the 10 inches here. 65 for the head. Woo! They ain't playing. Uh, 65 for the for the Niffler. Oh man, I got that 35. <laughs> okay, let's look. Let's look. Oh man, look at this. This is a this is a big one. We're gonna see. We're gonna see what we have here. Yeah, people, everybody and their mother messaging me right now. 
at that Finley gauntlet. Look at that. Missed out on that, unfortunately. You got Zeno up there. Oh, thirty dollars, man. Charmant. Charmant. I got like literally almost all these DVCs. Gear for fifty. Oh. Look at that. Oh, there's a beast, six hundred and fifty dollars. Don't have that either. Or that red skull for five fifty. Oh, that three fifty go in the dark ghost rider. You got that stone keeper up there. That's seventy five. That's awesome. I got that venom. Got all of the chromes, excluding the Star Lord. I saw over there at the other booth for like thirty five. Might have to go check that back out. That's what I'm really hunting for is that, that Star Lord. How many people am I collecting for right now? Probably like 30. I have a huge Excel spreadsheet of stuff. Um, and I just got messaged a few already. So are you guys looking for anything specific? What can I hunt for for you? I'm gonna step out of this booth a little bit. It's a bit crowded. I want to take up all the space. How long have you been collecting for? Oh, not how many are you hunting? So I've been collecting for about three years now. I actually have a local fa Facebook group where I'm at called Hampton Roads Funko. Uh, that's really a collector-centric group. Uh, we really try to help out the community finding all the pops they've always wanted. How many people do you have? Pops you have? Sell so that. Same as YouTube. I only started recently collecting them, and they say recently I have missed month two, two. It's an addiction, man. Once you start collection, collecting, it's gonna keep going. Okay, booth's cleared out a bit. I don't want to take away all their space. So who is this? This is actually Undiscovered Realm. Toys games. Look, they have a website right there. UndiscoveredRealm.com. Okay. Got the Korath. 25. Nice. This is a genius idea. For all of you guys who don't have a store, you don't understand how how smart of an idea this is. I might have to ask them about that. That is pure genius. Pure genius. I'm going to find out if they have a chase goose. Do you guys have a chase goose by chance? We don't. Um, they're okay. coming. They're shipping out soon. Okay. Um, cool. We just haven't got them in. And we sold out of the regulars. Yeah. He's popular. I will say that your display is genius. I have a small setup where I live. And I never thought of this. this is we try to keep it organized. Oh, I, I saw you on YouTube yesterday. Oh, yeah, I'm on YouTube right now too. Hey, nice. Way to be, bud. Way to oh, thanks, man. Thanks. Well, look at that. Now that person recognized me from my YouTube channel. That's exciting. I feel so cool now. Like a mini celebrity here. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Let's find some more. Pups. They actually had a crane machine over here that I kind of want to try. I mean, you're going to have guaranteed box damage at the pop if you win anything, but it had pops in it. It was cool. They had a couple, uh, they actually had a couple, um, a couple good ones in there too. Uh, so let's go take a look. I mean, everybody has, and we'll see that there's tons, 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 tons of pops here. Okay. Here we go. Look at this. More pops. More pops than your heart can desire at this place. If you're a pop hunter, this is where you need to be. C2E2. Oh, sounds like my headset's dying. I have to plug that one in for everybody. Some non live content here. Look at this. Oh, look at that. Now, there's some fair prices. A fruit pipe magician for 35 instead of 65. <laughs> There's another exhibitor over here. He has a fruit pie. He has it for $65. Like, oh, God, man. <laughs> He's going gonna to be sitting there all weekend, too. <laughs> so, he had where we are. He had a Jason Voorhees. Uh, he had one for 30. And then he had another one. Zach same one two feet down for 45. <laughs> That's the way to be. Oh, man. I have like nearly every Marvel pop and nearly every DBZ pop and I'm like I have a shopping list. I came here from Virginia for like for like a bunch of people. And so that was like I tell them, yo, you give me your money, I'll do what you need to do. Exactly. Don't be like, go get me something, you tell me what you want and you give me the money that you want. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, I uh, I do I have a YouTube channel too, so I'm over doing this live videos and stuff for people. 
It felt cool. I've had two people stop me because they there recognized me. I was like, oh man. Now, fanboy yeah. Fanboy collectibles. Fanboy collectibles. Check people, check them out. Cheap plug. That's uh, social media right there. We're pretty dope. There you go. Let's look up there. They ship all over. They ship. Got these beautiful statues up here. Oh, those are amazing. Of my life. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Those breaks. I'm They're... dead. If I happen to die, they don't care. <laughs> these are very beautiful. I love that Iron Spidey up there. It's amazing. Uh, you guys have Michael Myers there, 25, that's fair. that's fair. Do you guys have Billy by chance? Who's that? Billy from Saw? No. A guy has it over there, 75. He said it's vaulted, it's going up. Ain't going that much up. <laughs> yeah, no. I can see it right now on Pop Price Guy for 30. I've seen vaulted and pop, and I'm like, no, some of y'all are crazy. Man, I feel so cool. I'm rich now. I have all three of the my One Punch Man pops. Oh, nice. <laughs> Got it for 10. <laughs> Now after 30 days, they'll they'll drop back down. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you gotta let them rest. That resting price is a lot different. Oh man. Man, that uh, you got the David S. Pumpkins with skeletons. You hit or miss, man. Sometimes it's good, sometimes it's not. I have one too. Man, the one. We haven't been selling that one. We maybe been selling the Dick in the Box ones that people love. Yeah. Yeah, that one's been really popular. That and I have a site in a little shop where I'm from, and basically, some of these ones I get on trade, sometimes they pan out good, sometimes they don't. A lot of times I've ended up giving away half of them. Right. <laughs> yeah, here, take it. You guys have a good day. Oh man, it's great. Look at this cosplay, Mad Hatter. Oh man. Look at that, people. Okay, somebody say something, I missed it. Yeah, Chris. Oh, it's day two, Chris. It is good. Busy. Okay. People, 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 people. Let me go over here. Oh, to the crane machine. I was going to show you guys. Uh, <coughs> crane machine, where are you at? Man, how charged my phone? Ooh, 71%. Nice. I'll be able to stream for quite a while. Ooh, where did that go? Oh, look, more pops. Look at all this. They got pops. Now these guys, these guys had a great idea. See, they have this plastic here. And they have it all outward facing to keep their thing from getting all metallic whisk. 150, whoa! Baja Mi 100, 150? It's not even signed! Oh man. 150 non-signed Baja Vegeta. Hey pal, friends and family. No notes. <laughs> No, they did have one I thought was pretty cool. They had a, um, a signed uh, Naruto one that was a decent price, in my opinion. But, oh goodness, oh goodness. Majin Poo, Poo. Look at that. Got that Zeno, that's nice. Got that one too. Let's see. Look at this, people. Look at this. Saitama. Look, where'd he go? Am I blind up? Oh, there he is, all down there at the bottom. <laughs> Man, some of these people, they are disrespectful with prices. They're asking for some things. Okay, let's take a look. Uh, okay, let's look and see if we can find those metallic turtles that I have somebody friend looking for. I'm gonna take a look here. Ooh, I do like the little thing. Look at that, people. Metallic ants and animal. Whoa. Okay, okay. I like the DC superheroes. Oh, how would I look? I would love that pot. Anybody want to send me four hundred dollars? Excuse me. Look, 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 look. I'm looking for a Billy. A Billy. Oh man, look at all these Stan Lees. If they had an autographed one, oh man, I would be in heaven. Child's play. Billy, 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 Jason, no. Excuse me, sorry. Look at this, people. Look at this. Look at these. 
sign Kevin Smith. Look at that. Oh my god, they're watching me waiting savage. That's my lord mistaken to me. These things are well organized. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, people. Ooh, that was a cool one, Mr. Negative. I like that. I have that myself too. Buzz off. I see a limited edition con exclusive one, so that means that's not a shared exclusive. That's why you're running that price. Haranga con exclusive, not shared exclusive. Awesome. You guys see anything good yet? I just was over there, they had the Majin Vegeta unsigned for 150. I'm like, ooh, that's a little steep. I'm for... <laughs> yeah, the room, it's very expensive. Yeah, well, see, so the difference is, unlike the Hot Topic, which will say shared exclusive on the sticker, this is actually from ECC. So they went there and they got it that day. So the sticker's different. If you're not a sticker fan, the Hot Topic has plenty of them. But if you're a sticker fan, the sticker's different. So on the Hot Topic one, it'll say ECC shared exclusive versus the... Uh, the limited edition so the difference is the sticker uh, but yeah it is expensive but like I said if you're not a sticker person which all these are the six stickers uh, from that day so you see limited 1,000 pieces this is actually not a shared so. but the, this one and these ones are shared so if you're not a sticker fan hot to each Hot Topic got like 50 of these each but if you're a sticker guy that's where it's at <laughs> Ooh, ooh, ooh. Look at this, people. Let's take a look. Let's take a look. Oh, churros? Yum. One away from 100. I know, Mole. We got to get that one more person in here. That one more person. Ah, oh, look. Martian from Tacon. From Mars. Oh, Met 1200. King Felix. Oh, man. They got some some of my personal personal grails up in here. Look at that, people. It's Fugitive Toys, everyone. Uh, they wanted 75 for Billy. Okay, hey people, I'm gonna let you stare at this for a second. I'm messaging somebody. Okay, hey, people, I'm literally flooded with messages right now. This way. This way. Over here. Oh man, I'm gonna be live until my phone dies. Hopefully that's live enough, long enough for y'all. We're gonna keep looking. Uh, I've looked at all the over here. We're gonna keep going. Oh, look at this, right behind us. Oh man, how did I miss that? It's no. Good stuff up there, everyone. I think this is Toytastic. Okay. <laughs> $10 hard stacks. Man, I should have came over here instead of getting those FYE ones. Oh, man. Okay, let's take a look. You have a question? Okay. Thank you. Look, here you go, people. Do you guys have any questions? Or just look at them. Do you have a Jason Voorhees? I should. 
Vince. Or a Billy Common. Like Billy from Saw? Yeah. That's not a common anymore. I, well, I, it's vaulted. <laughs> I know. It's like, oh, yeah, no, I know it's I'm vaulted, bad. but like, uh. you got some of the people at the, I've seen them at a couple of the booths and they're a little bit out of their mind with, with how much they think the vaulted price is. <laughs> Yeah, the new Funko app is nice because it tells you what's vaulted and right, what's right. not now. Yep. It's no longer relying on what uh, the licensed retailers say. I'm looking for the one. I see a Jason down there, but I'm looking oh. for the one where he has the burlap sack. Oh, the, uh, I have it on the outside wall. I'll take a look, man. Thanks. Okay, he said he has them on the outside wall. We're going to take a look. See if they have the Jason Voorhees out here. A little bit better here, a little bit better. Mm, look at that, people. Mm. Oh, Jason Voorhees, he has 35. Mm. I mean, they have some good values here, some stuff or some fair prices. Some stuff, not so much. This this booth seems pretty good. I'd say so. Uh, pretty good. But the worst booth I've seen is probably on the other side of the con. They were. Uh, yeah, I see him. You have you have them for 35, I think, yeah. over here. What do you guys been hunting for? You want me to go try to find it and see what they got here for you? I'll take a look. Hey, oh, hey, Michael. Yeah, they they do, Michael. I'm uh. Just kind of taking a peek right now. I got most of what I wanted already, and I'll, I'll share in a video um, later. But um, just kind of peeking around. Let's go keep looking, guys. Oh, look, another f pop venue bin. Literally, this con is full of mystery bags, mystery boxes, or two mainstream. Let's take a look. All four for 36. Mm -hmm. Hello. Got, uh, Mystery bags. Yes. Okay, they fifteen. Contain either um, commons, exclusives, or three. These three grails right here. Who? Mm. What do you think, YouTube? What do you guys think? Should I do it? I don't know. Let's look inside their booth. <laughs> I like it. Mystery bags. Yeah. <laughs> Hello, how are you doing? Good. How are you? Doing good. So, you guys are uh, Chi Town Toys and Collectibles? Awesome. My name is Ali, by the way. I uh, actually have a YouTube channel and I, uh, a collector and seller myself. So, I'm doing live videos right now. I've had a few people already come up to me, uh, coming in. Pop centric. So, right now I'm live. If you want, I could point it on you and you can introduce yourself and talk about your toys. I don't mind. Sorry. Uh, so, we're here today at uh, CQE 2019. And uh, we have our Funko Pops here. We have a sale on all these. They're 11 each, 2 for 20, 3 for 27, and 4 for 36. So if you're here, make sure you stop by our booth, 17.45. Okay. We also have uh, these Necro figures with $30 each, and these cool Mighty Jacks. These are, these are brand new uh, Mighty Jack figures. We just got these in. So yeah, if you're interested, make sure you stop by. Thank you. Appreciate yeah, it. thanks, man. I like the mystery bags, 15 inches. So far, that's the best one. It seems like everybody has a mystery box. Every aisle has like four of them, but that's a good one, man. Yeah. Mystery bags. So let me ask you, I see that you said that there's a chance for one of those three pops. Uh -huh. So are, are there only three of them in the entire lot? Yes, there's three okay. in the entire lot, and then you got commons and exclusives. So it's a good uh, ratio between them. Awesome. Common. Yeah, I saw one, he was like 12, uh, a mystery box for 60 with 12 pops. And he said they're all commons, and there's no chance at anything better. And I was like, hmm. And he's valuing it based on uh, Amazon, not on Pop Price Guide or Stashpedia or anything. So I'm gonna pass on that one. <laughs> but yeah, might have to come back for the $15 bag no problem. and open it up. I always do unboxings. I do all that stuff on my channel. Oh, you're the only one so far I've seen with this one, with the Gotinks. It's awesome. Okay, guys. I waited in line uh, yesterday for five hours because oh, yeah. Chris Sabat came a little late and went on break. Uh, but, Oh, look at that. Fruit Pie Magician. Another person with a good price. There's a, there's a vendor way up there. He has it for $65. Yeah, the, the <laughs> best prices in the, one of the, in the whole convention, I think. We have some of the best prices. No, absolutely. They're a lot a lot fairer. Uh, but yeah, it's cool. Uh, right now, I'm, I'm on a hunt for certain ones for some friends. They're looking for Jason Voorhees with a mask and a, a Billy uh, Common, the vaulted one. But and some, They're looking for a few Pez, Pez's, but I don't see it. So. 
Awesome. I'll be back. Thank you. No problem. Thank you guys for stopping by. Yeah. I'll definitely check you guys out. I love that fruit. Oh my goodness. Definitely. Thank you, man. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Okay, let me get a close up of it too. You guys, check out their Instagram, Facebook. They have a website. Are you, are you on Instagram? Yeah, yeah, I'm on Insta. That's me right there, the blue one. Oh, this one. Yep. The first one is a popsicle thing that has the same name as me. Okay. <laughs> All right, cool. Yep. This one right now is YouTube Live. Okay. Yep. But yeah, I have Instagram, Facebook. I have it all, and I do news. Yeah. Hey. I do Instagram news. I do everything. Yep. There you guys go. Oh yeah. Thank you. Let's go look, man. Look. See, like I said, mystery boxes everywhere. Everybody has a mystery box. It's the best way to unload your comments. <laughs> Do a mystery box. Oh man. Okay, let's take a look here. Chris, hey Chris, I'm still looking for you, man. I haven't seen the pop you're looking for yet, at least not at a fair price. Hey, how are you guys doing? Good, good. I love when I see fair prices. <laughs> so, I've only I've only been on one booth so far that I've I would give a thumbs down on. Really? A fruit pie magician for sixty five dollars. Yeah, like yeah, we we try to keep it real, man. And we had Brongi yesterday for forty guys for charging ninety. I mean, it was like it was nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know some of them are like the con exclusives, of and course. some of them are like the hot topic ones. That's true. I'm not a sticker guy, so yeah. like. Oh, but, okay, look at this. They got all kinds. Oh, it's got the. Is it customs? Aren't they? Yes. Custom Legos. I've always wondered how custom Legos are made. Do you guys like make your own molds and they then design uh, and stuff? And they've got a, a guy who's got to own the factory and yeah, they put it all together. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's cool. I've started recently doing like custom pops, like I airbrush and everything, and it's it's been exciting. I actually have a uh, YouTube and Instagram There's and everything uh, for nice. pops called Pop Centric, and okay. I got lucky. A few people have recognized me today, cool, and I've cool. just been walking around trying to show off everything. Yeah, so awesome. there's a lot of Funko booths here, so yeah, definitely. Uh, Master Roshi for 15 people. This is a fair price. Fair price. <laughs> Somebody charging 35 for it early. Oh, out of their yeah. mind. Awesome. Thank you. Take it easy. Yep. And that's how you can tell they're a small time re small time seller because they have specialty series. You won't see yeah. these at Target or Hot Topic or anything yeah. like that. Oh, yeah, I have my own store. So. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Thank you. you. Guys, have a good one. Okay. Let's keep looking. Let's keep looking. Okay, okay, look, see, it's not idea. That's all right, Matt. Look that. Okay, pops, 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 pops. Oh, man, this is not pop, but I'm gonna have to come over here and show you guys this because this thing is literally the coolest thing I've ever seen. I saw this booth earlier yesterday and I hadn't stopped by yet, but man, look at the bust. That is so cool. So cool. As you guys probably are aware, I'm the biggest Marvel superhero fan in the world. And man, look at these. These are. Beautiful. Oh look, mask up. Do both their masks come up or is it just this one? No, it's just that one. That is really cool. This is the Robert Downey Jr. too. You can tell. Look at the face. That's cool. This is sweet. Oh, it goes down too? Oh man. That is literally the coolest thing I have I think I've ever seen. Oh man, what do you guys think my wife will do if I come back with a $3,000 Iron Man statue? I don't know, I don't know, I might. Uh, this is beautiful, this is, this is amazing. Marvelous merchandise. Do what? You gotta pick it up for Marvelous merchandise. Marvelous merchandise, you guys see that? Okay, look at this. I am like the world's biggest Marvel fan. Uh, I just saw recently this company was like, paying a thousand dollars to somebody who's willing to binge watch it but they give you a test first to make sure you actually know about it right. but they're what's like you, what's your site uh so i do mostly pops but uh pop centric is my uh is what i follow but like i have to come over here man this is marvel <laughs> but yeah um but yeah they didn't my uh my personal social media where all my marvel stuff is posted they're like nah we need you to have a few hundred thousand more subscribers like that doesn't seem very fair. You'll probably be a thousand if I have a hundred thousand subscribers to binge watch. Mm. <laughs> they guess doing more for you than it is for me at that point. <laughs> but yeah, I do mostly pops. Uh, but but yeah, oh man, I love this. <laughs> okay, people, we're gonna move on now. We're gonna move on. I'll, I'll stop looking at the non-pop stuff. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Oh wait, that's where I was going. I was going to that claw machine. Sci-fi wire C2E2 live. Whoa! I did not even realize all this was over here. I haven't been this far, far this way yet. Where's my battery at? 62%. We got time. Once I get to about 30, I'll probably take a brief, brief intermission. So that way I can uh, 
charge up my stuff. Oh look, more weapons. I'm gonna have to bring Yusuf over here to show him that. Okay. Fifty percent off all trade paperbacks. What? <laughs> okay. Let's go. Look. Got sci-fi over there. Oh look, we got some more pops, people. You ready? Look at that. Look at that. So much stuff. 25 for that Walmart exclusive. Like when he came right in, he got a bunch of the, I didn't know about the chase on um, the dispensers. Those go for like bananas money. Oh man, you guys hear that. Oh look, we got sci-fi. We're doing a live panel right now. Who is it for? Let's go take a look. Let's see who's on the stage right now. What time is it? 11, 12? Ooh, do, do, 1230, I'm gonna go do something really exciting. Sci-Fi Wire Con kickoff. Today's Saturday. Underfoot. Fox Brown talks a new book. Pac-Man and Colin, Daniel interview. It's cast, William. Dragon Ball Z voice cast, whoa. Let's take a look at that. We all know how I feel about that. How many pops a month do you buy? Too many, too many. Uh, probably like 20 or 30. If not more. That's for really, really trying to to milk that one. See, the thing about these cons is you gotta know, you gotta know the know what you're looking at, know your prices, because they will they will get you good. Take a look here. You guys see anything cool? Come around. Saga, whoa. Uh, some more over here. 320. <laughs> okay, you guys, you guys see this one. This, this might be, this is a good one. Look, we got Faker up there. $325. Wow, woo, woo. You thought the, 100, the people were selling for 100 were bad. Look at that, $325. Oh man, is he actually here? I might have to have him sign one of these for me. How to submit for Grab a Six Series fill in. Oh man. Woo. Okay, look, more mystery boxes. Whoa. <laughs> Surprise. Do you ever bring a tent for your kids? Genius. I'll have to bring, I never thought of doing that. Okay, man, I'm still looking for. Oh, there it is. There's the Funko Pop vending machine. Or you can use a crab. Grab some. Oh, look, the Incredibles family. Whoa. Oh, look at this, you guys. I'm telling you, this. It's off the chain. We got some more pops out of nowhere toys over there. I'm gonna go check them out first. I wanna show off what's going on over here. It's a really cool machine. Said comes with complimentary box damage, but that's okay. It's the experience that you're paying for. It's a dollar a play. Look, look, they still have that Stan Lee. They have something stacked on top of it. Wait for the poor person who's gonna go after that door so I can go for the Stan Lee. Oh man, it's beautiful. Dollar, I don't even know if I have a dollar. I'll have to look. I don't think so though. Okay, let's take a look here. A few ones. I got this Iron Man for 12. It's not bad. It's not terrible. Looking at one of those for a custom I want to do, so. Maybe, maybe, maybe. It's a whole lot of, lot of comments. Here we go. We got Nowhere Toys, Comics, and Gaming. We're going to go check them out. See what they have going on here. Man, this video is long. It's probably my longest video. 45 minutes. Going strong here. I'm very strong. I'm going to keep looking. Okay. Let's take a look. Okay, people. We got up there. We got up there. So far, I haven't quite, quite found any, anything. Did I see anything good yet? Oh, look. There's the con exclusive. Specialty series Wolfman. Whoa, I haven't seen one of those in a while. Let's see, look at their top row. Their top row is good looking. That's a cool one. I have that myself. Oh, look, they got that Walmart Comic Con edition. Can't see that. Oh, dude, there's an all my pop right Look at 
that. <laughs> Look at that, people. Don't see any of the ones I'm looking for right now. Mm, mm, mm. You guys see any Jason Voorhees? Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Do you have a Jason Voorhees with the sack or a or a Billy Common? Billy who? Billy from Saw Common? Oh, no, I don't. Metallic Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Oh, man. What you want to look for is down that way. Yeah, I saw some over there, but a guy has some some interesting prices. He had a uh, uh, Voorhees, he went over like $45 and he has like the Billy Common, he wants 75 Like I get it's yeah, voted. They, uh, it, well it's voted but like it still has a, a resting value of like $40. Right. So, but, Awesome. I just wanted to show up your booth. I was here earlier. Um, wanted to come back and show everybody. Yeah. Okay, excuse me. Okay people. Let's keep moving. Let's keep moving. Let's keep moving, 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 moving. You know what I would love is having a, um, looking for that, uh, Luis, a Belcher. It'd be nice. That one I would probably buy in a heartbeat if I saw. Uh, uh, uh. Okay. See, look, more pops. Like, this is a uh, comic book place, but looks like they have a few pops at the back there. Fancy. Oh man, look at these paintings. It's beautiful. Look at that. Oh man. That's, that's cool. I like it. I like it. I like it a lot. Okay. Where's my phone at? 56%. Okay, people, we got about 20 more cent. And then we're gonna move on. Chuck load of comics. Okay. Okay, look at that. You guys see in this place, I have to charge up my, back up my uh, GoPro here, charge up my phone here in a few minutes. Don't want it to die in the middle of this awesomeness. Uh, I might go till 12.30, let it go a little bit lower so that way I can watch that VRV presentation. All right, it's uh, charging up, I don't want to miss that. Penelope, that's cool. Okay, I think I'm mostly in Comic Alley here because I don't see a whole lot of anything. Okay, okay. Oh. All the artists here, as you can see, a lot, a lot of artists. This is pretty cool. Look at that. Whoa. Steady. We go back this way some. I haven't really explored this area yet, so we'll keep taking a look, see if we can find anything new. This is Artist Alley, so I think we're. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we got, people. Oh, look at that. Hello, that was cool. Oh, excuse me, sorry. Kosher Deli. That's exciting. I got some good stuff, man. Look at this. Cool stuff. Woo! Woo! Look at that. You're the only one that Oh, look at that Ghostbusters car. Whoa. Hi. Nice. So we got 100. Okay. Well, I guess we'll be doing a giveaway when I get back home. It makes me happy. Finally, it took me long enough to get to the 100 subscribers. When I get back, we'll uh, I'll go ahead and t list every single one of my subscribers, and we'll uh, oh, yes. we'll do it. We'll do a giveaway. Yeah, you guys are Thank you guys. It's gonna be for a King Ding Dong and a hard stack, completely uh, free to anybody who has subscribed to my YouTube channel. And then I'll message them directly to let them know. They don't respond within. I'll give them like five days, and then we'll do the drawing again for someone else. You are congratulations. You are my hundredth subscriber. You're you're the reason we are going to be able to do that giveaway. So thank you. 
I'm gonna keep going. We're gonna keep going here. We're gonna keep looking. There's a lot of pops at this this place. I do have Twitter. It's the name Pop Centric. I also have Instagram as well and Facebook. People. Okay, let's take a look. What do they got? What do we got? Still don't see what I'm looking for. getting tired. We walk, we walk, we walk, we walk, we look, we look, we look. So who is this? This is HotSauceGames.com. Mystery bag, three Funko Pops, 25, chance at a chase, or ECCC Blue Bigfoot. Woo, that is a good chance. Look at that. That's a good... Ah, come on, focus. Look at that. Um, not local, but, uh, I can share it too. Right we got a lot of stuff. Just make me please. Yeah, Facebook messages or whatever. Do you want to pay for I'm in. For 325 this definitely takes the cake on the craziest markup I have ever seen. Oh, I saw it. I just sold it. I'm like, that's like two days ago. Space Jam, we got that stroke. Yeah, man, no problem. Buzz off. It is cool. Okay, let's go. Which way do we want to go? We're going to go back this way. 1124. Ooh. Good. Where are we at? My phone. 53%. Still holding strong. Oh, this is not all super streetwear. This is some really cool stuff here. Look at that. That's cool. Like that. Oh, man. This area was really cool. It has the gaming area. We're destroying it here. East DePaul Esports. Can't say. Oh look! Like I said, pop 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 pop. Oh, pops 50% off. Woo! Let's take a look. Fifty percent off. Okay. Oh, one of those cleaners that hot topic for three dollars the other day. <laughs> Look at that, people. Oh, woo, that box. Some of these boxes are rough. This must be the 50% off box damage sale. Oh, man. You see, they have a PR up back there. Okay. Okay. Do you know what it is? You guys see what I see? The back of people's heads. This place is crowded. Crowded. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's neat. Okay, okay. Let's keep walking. Let's keep walking. Oh, man. Fantasy skate decks, that's cool. Snap a picture like this later. Just snap a picture of the URL. It'll take you like five seconds of that. Some great cosplay. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. Haha, <laughs> Saitama, that's perfect. Yeah. 
Oh uh, man, yeah, I'm thirsty. I have to go take a small break. Get a drink. Okay. Whoop, found some more pops. <clears throat> I think it's a little bit more further over there. So we can okay, just... okay, here we go, people. Here we go, we go. Let's try to take a look. Let's see. Okay. Hey, hundos, they got a good one over there. Look at that. Okay. Too hard to see, too far, so we're going to keep looking. Go stand by H. Thank you, Sandwich Man Army EGB. How many Marble Pops are you missing? I'm probably missing maybe a small handful, maybe like 10 or 11, but most of the ones I'm missing are like super high in grails and I just can't bring myself to spend, you know, hundreds to thousands of dollars on a, uh, on a pop toy as much as I love it. I just can't afford that. I'm not in a position in life where I can drop a grand. Okay, here's a big booth over here with Pops. About the saw the other day. <clears throat> We're gonna go take a look at that one. It's probably one of the biggest ones in this area too. This guy had a lot of good stuff. Okay, okay, we we'll try to find the best way and look. Here we go. He's got a lot, lot. Go on the inside. We're gonna try to go in there, but before we do that, because there's a lot of people, we're gonna look around here. See, see, see. Looky, 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 looky. Man, this guy has a massive collection. It's great when you buy lots from people. Oh, look, here's an entrance. It's not too crowded. Let's look. Okay. This is probably the biggest pop booth in the entire convention. What's this guy's name? I don't even know. We can see a company. If he has a website or anything, he's the only con guy, I guess. It's okay. Want to hear academia? Yeah. Oh my god, this booth is on here. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, people. I'm trying to get through here. This is a lot. As you can see, there are hundreds of people in this little area. Hundreds of people in the area. Hundreds. We're looking, we're looking. Uh, you know, sorry to any of you people following me in Hampton Roads Funko. I've been looking for y'all, but I say some of this stuff is definitely priced to be at a con price. So, only so much I can do. I mean, I don't think you guys want to pay three times PPG price on some of these. Uh, we're moving, we're moving, we're moving. Ah, ah, made it. Okay, sorry, it seems to be a little less. Excuse me, is this your booth? Or what can uh, this? I'm doing some video, but do you I have, have something. Do you have a Billy? Uh, Billy. From Saw? No. Saw. Non glow. And then also Jason Voorhees with the burlap sack. Okay. You have great questions. You see that guy standing right there? Yeah. He knows that. Okay, thanks. All right, sure. Yep. Look at that, people. They have so much. So much. <clears throat> Excuse me, I'll send to you. Do you have a Jason Voorhees with the burlap sack mask? Uh, what about a Billy Com uh, Common uh, from Saw? Okay, awesome. Thanks, man. What is your What is your What is your booth called, by the way? I looked. I don't see a name or anything. Do oh, there we go. Thanks. No, there's nobody at. Here you guys. Toys bot. Oh, excuse me. Uh, we're gonna look some more. Let me uh, put this in my pocket real quick. I'm trying to watch the time. I don't want to miss that new VRV presentation. Okay. Okay. 
Saitama. Nice. Oh. I'm just curious on what the prices are. Do have any prices on it? Okay. Do you know how much they are each? No idea. No idea. That's, that's, that's what they're banking on. You're going to get the register. Like, oh, I'm already here. Yeah, I'm just... There's a, there's I've been looking for two bucks. Oh, is it? Whatever. I think it's like... It's Excuse me, excuse me, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Excuse me, how much is like the Saitama and Genesis and stuff? Because I don't see any prices anywhere. 15? Okay, thank you. Okay, so that's a really good price. Yes, Saitama here for $15. He has a bunch of them. Very. Good looking. Oh, I see. I see. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. Look at that. I think we know what's going on here, don't we? Okay. Okay. I see. I see. I see. Okay, I'm out, people. You saw, you see what I see, you know what I mean. These, uh, pretty sure are knockoffs. Not confident on that one. Some of these look very interesting. That you don't keep up with prices or you're too good of deals. Let's see. You got any confir confirmations here? Anybody able to confirm anything? Look, I should have brought mine with me. Box. Pretty confident that's not how that's supposed to look. Let's pull up some Funko. <laughs> like, look, like they're charging 15 for that. Like, come on, give me a break. Thank you, thank you. Ava, like I said, this booth is. Mm, I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. Some of these are just, this might be the, the uh, exciting booth, the booth with a little, uh, no, no, I don't know, I don't know if I trust this, it's too much, scared, scared of that booth, okay people, I've been at over an hour now on this live, 45% to 11.30, excuse me, I think I might walk back out to my car real quick. Some of, these, some of these pop prices, I said people are too good to be true. When something's too good to be true, it probably is. So I'm going to pass on this. I'm going to go to someone I know, like Fugitive or Galactic, which are here as well. So. Uh, uh, okay, I'm gonna go this way. I haven't been this way yet. We're gonna see what's going on. Oh man. Oh, on, excuse me, go. sorry. Oh, look. Of course, I listen to what Zoltar has to tell you. Dream as if you will forever. Live as if you die today. That's right. Live your days as if you die. That's cool. Because one day they will be. You know what I mean. So go on. Have fun. I'm sorry. It's funny. Okay, we're time. 11:30. Still got some time. Still got some time. I might go back to VRV and ask him again. I want to go back there and find out. There. Oh man. So we know that when I go back, I'm gonna probably go back and do some, download this video, do some editing. And we're gonna say we got, so far the most overpriced pop was a faker at $325. That is purely amazing. I cannot 
my right mind believe that somebody thought that they could get that much out of it. Okay, let me go find VRV. I need them to tell me again when that, uh, what, what area they're in. Probably gonna call it a, a day for a little bit, take a break, charge up my phone and my uh, GoPro, and I'll go back live here in maybe a, a few hours. It's going on till 7. It's only 11.30, so we, we got some time. Man, man, it's tired. What? What? Galact Toys over there. Pre-order the latest toys online. That's true. Always tell me when that pre Brawly pre-orders up. Then I'll be happy. Controller chaos. Custom Xbox controllers. That is neat. Look at that. Woo! Let's take a look, people. This is a Funko page, but I can't say that that is not. You gotta respect that. That is amazing. Look at that. Everybody play. That's cool stuff. Okay. Got sidetracked. Going back. Maybe. Ah! So many people. So many people. Okay, it's VRV. Head back over there. We're gonna. Back over here again. I'm gonna ask him. Oh. I totally forgot earlier you told me that there's gonna be a new show premiering at 12:30. What venue? What like stage was it on? It's inside. Well, it's part of the birth panel. So the first half is a birth panel, and the second half is during the uh, birth uh, panel at 12:30 in S403. S403. Cool. Yeah. That's where I want to go. So the panels for the first half of it, and the back half will be the episode, first episode of WZRD. Awesome. Yeah. Thank you. Welcome. Oh, what network is doing WZRD? No, it's on Verve actually. What? Well, yeah, I know, but like you have Mondu, Crunchyroll. Yeah, no, it's actually Verve is producing it. Oh, Ver VRV Verve Select. Yeah, Verve Select. Okay, awesome. Thank yeah, you. Welcome. Okay, people. I think I pretty much showed you a lot of the stuff. You could just join us. There's a whole hour worth of video to watch. Um, if you've been on this the whole time, I thank you. I thank you for riding along with me. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter, uh, Instagram, and Facebook. Instagram is where I kind of upload pictures and things of stuff I see, stuff I like, and some news occasionally. Twitter is where I put most of my news information about Pops coming out. And Facebook is really just a great way to message me and interact with me because I can get a hold of that about any time. So, so far for me, uh, I would say the best booth, even though I didn't have necessarily the largest selection, was definitely going to be the Fugitive Toys one, uh, followed by a strong second with Galactic Toys. Um, and then we had a couple other small booths around here that were pretty awesome. And uh, they offered some cool stuff. Oh man, anime, whoa! So, you know, I don't know how much more there is to, to show you guys. We've been at. It's a long time. Now, I will say, leave some comments in the sections below if you want me to look at anything specific. If you want me to go to Galactic Toys and show and see if they have some, I'll be glad to do that. But man, they have. There's a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff here. Woo! Okay. So, this is where I'm going to call it quits because I'm going to go get something to drink. Maybe get something to eat. And then, ooh, Monster Espresso. I think so. Okay. Awesome. Have a good one. See you later, Pop.